Hello, this is Sebastian from Native Instruments. In this video, we will show you how to re-add a Native Instruments contact library that has already been installed on one of your hard drives. In recent versions of Contact 5, the libraries are being managed by our service tool Native Access. At the moment, it's not possible to re-add already installed contact libraries with Native Access, but our developers are already working on implementing this feature. In the meantime, we are offering you the workaround presented in this video, which includes a temporary downgrade to contact version 566. We understand that this situation is far from ideal, but we are convinced that using this workaround is quicker and more convenient than having to download whole libraries again. First, download the contact 566 installer from the links provided in the description of this video. Please choose your operating system, and if you're using the full version of contact, or the player version. Double-click the DMG file and launch the installer to start the installation process. On Windows, right-click the zip file and choose Extract All. Then, run the installer. Please note that you will be asked to allow downgrading and to continue with this process several times, which you can always confirm. Mac users also have to enter their admin password. When the installation is finished, you can close the installation window. Now launch the Contact standalone application. Select the Libraries tab and click Add Library. In the new window, navigate to the library that you want to add. In this example, we are adding Alicia's Keys, which has been installed on an external hard drive. Select the Library folder and confirm your choice. If you're on Mac, enter your administrator password in the pop-up window. Alicia's Keys now appears in the Library tab. You can repeat this process until all of your libraries are added. Please don't click the Activate button of any library since the activation process will be done with native access. Once you are finished adding your libraries, you can close contact. Next, to activate your libraries, open Native Access and log in with your Native Instruments user account's email address and password. Go to the Installed Products tab. As you can see, your contact library has been automatically activated. Finally, go to the Available Updates tab and install all available updates to make sure that you are using the current version of Contact and of your library.